Say God, Amen. Without regard for its meaning, say God. Prior to interpretation, say God. Remember to say God and say God. Say God continually without interruption. If interrupted, begin anew and say God. Say God with each breath, each footstep, each eye blink. Say God without anxiety or strain. Say God like a river of God's sayings. While living in an evil time or region, say God. In throes of mounting bliss, say God. On guard before the mirror, say God, Amen. May the lover's pact simply be to say God. Sealed, unsealed, say God. Between certainty and doubt, say God. Confronted by elaborate systems, say God. Facing beautiful simplicities, say God. Let the interjection of awe and wonder remain God. Repeatedly say God, yet be thou not obsessed. To say God is to sing God. To sing God is to draw near to God, to the nearness that is God. Say God is the only increment. Say God now. Say God despite that which would prevent one from saying God. Say God and know it to be so. Say God until reality is consumed by God saying. Say God as if pouring water from one vessel into another. Say God in secret. Say God and conceal it from oneself. Say God. It is miraculous to have said God, to have attained to that orientation whereupon one must utter the word God. Say God and welcome the inevitable. Say God to sustain co-mutual clairaudience throughout a Christ realm, saying God. Say God as you know you have been born. Say God as a holy Bible read aloud and all scripture springs from a single sound. Say God in the name of the inutterable name. Say God, amen. Say God when you say the name of Christ Jesus to help you say God. To say God is to copulate for millions of years, amen. This you and I of God's sound sayings. To say God is to continue knowing it to be so. Say God in the heart's eye hears thee, amen. Say God and tend the true cross planted in the centermost soil of your heart, amen. Say God and know you have always been saying God, parallel to all God seems or seems not, amen. The body is a God saying instrument, amen. The mind is a God-saying habitat. Amen. The soul is patient in its heart robe. The silence that frames the sound, amen. To say God is to walk with God in silence. Say God before and after having been distracted from saying God. That is, frame the lack of saying with an abundance of saying. 
frame it in time. Amen. To say God is to awake and say God. Amen. Say God when saying there has never been falsehood of any kind. And one's own God-saying form rises up from fundamental slime as it falls from undifferentiated cosm, coalescing the most transparent verse into a mountain of singing fire administered to your larynx by armored hummingbirds of vibrating script, laying open the occult by closing away the revealed into every flame of song combined quavering just prior to the destruction of this present moment. Amen. This moment that is the present covering of the true moment of total revelation. Amen. The complete teaching instantaneous. Amen. The spontaneous uprising of eons of devotion. Amen. In a nearness that is a living intelligence encountered in the joy itself of continuous spiritual labor preserved along a delicate chain of enlarged and present instances. Amen. Eternities attenuated through time. Amen. Time bodies forever forming. Amen. To say God is their present shaping. Amen. Say God and fold this cosmic ebb into a fervently small thing. Say God and say the swaddling bands of the enshrouding chrysalis. Say God and say the interior vastnesses of the heart region exceed cosmos. Amen. And therein the shepherd's fold doth freely migrate. Amen. And I, even you and I, are perfect components of an expression of divine limitlessness. Amen. Which is to say, truly, truly the larynx is a delicate nest of names. Amen. Which is to say, truly, truly our animal manifestations form the elegant scaffold of a roving and mighty temple. Amen. Which is to say, truly, truly, revelation is immediately bestowed upon those who wish to receive it as it is. That is, to become the revealed. Amen. Be free from all that is said and say God. Say God with a heart full of lust throughout the refracted rigors of piety and say, Lord God, hear this my sacrifice and accept my stumblings across your luminous shadow. Say God and say she who is he and say the proximity of the kingdom, the atom of holiness a regimented cloud swarm of holy atoms. Amen. Say the seam of symmetry, absolute unnameableness, and the origin of blasphemy. Amen. Say God and say that which passes through itself, interpenetrated, auto-pervaded. Amen. Say the constellator, girdled by trillions of lives. Say God the annihilation of curiosity, the supremely erotic, the gnasher of souls, the murmur in the stone, that which is suffered and enjoyed, that which goads and coaxes, that which welcomes and exiles. Amen. Say God a soothing disturbance, a mirrored countenance, bedecked with realities. Say the evaporation of knowledge. Say God against the God-sayers. To say God is to love God. That is, to intone God through all aspects of one's being. Say God 